In this video, I'll guide you on how to write and create a tech resume in Microsoft Word, step by step. If you're applying for a software engineer, developer, IT, or any tech job, this template will work for you. Before we start building, let's understand your resume's journey. When you submit it online, it first encounters the ATS, the Applicant Tracking System. This software scans hundreds of resumes and filters out those that don't match the job requirements. That's why we're building an ATS-optimized resume today. Once your resume passes the ATS, it goes to a recruiter, a hiring manager, and sometimes even the technical team in tech companies. At this stage, it needs to quickly prove you're the right fit for the role. Now, let's set up the document. Start with your full name at the top. Make it bold and prominent. Directly below, add a professional title like software engineer or full stack developer. This is optional, but it helps recruiters immediately understand your focus. Next, add your contact information professional email address, phone number, LinkedIn profile, GitHub profile, or portfolio website. GitHub is especially valuable in tech. It showcases your actual code and projects, which speaks louder than words. For location, simply list your city with either state or country. A full address isn't necessary. If you're open to remote work, write open to remote or remote, worldwide, beside, or instead of, your location. Now, which sections should you include in a tech resume, and what should come first? This depends on your experience. If you're a fresh graduate, your key sections are summary, skills, projects, and internships. Place them near the top. This shows you can do the job, even without years of experience. If you already have work experience, that becomes your main section. Start with it, because companies want to see real results from real jobs first. The summary section is optional if you have solid experience. Your work history usually speaks for itself. But if you're just starting out, it's a good way to introduce yourself. Mention your target role, your key technical skills, and the value you bring. Keep it short and focused. Now, let's add your work experience. Start with your most recent job first. Include your job title, company name, dates worked, and location. Below that, add a few short bullet points about what you achieved. Start each point with action words like built, developed, improved, created, or led. Focus on what you achieved, not just what you did. Use numbers when you can. Cutting load times by 40% is better than improved load times. Then, add your skills section. Group related skills together, like programming languages, frameworks, databases, and tools. This structure makes it easy for both ATS and recruiters to quickly scan your technical toolkit. After skills, add projects, certifications, or freelance work that are relevant and add real value to the job you're applying for. In a tech resume, the projects section is one of the most important. It shows your technical skills through real examples of what you've built. 
Add two to four projects that match the job you want. Write the project name and its short description. Finally, add your education. Mention your degree. University name and graduation year. That's enough, especially if you already have experience. If you're a fresher, list relevant computer science courses like data structures, algorithms, DBMS, or operating systems to show your technical foundation. And that's it, your professional tech resume is ready. You can download this free template using the link in the description. If this video helped you, make sure to like and subscribe for more resume and job related videos. Thanks for watching.